afternoon, hope you're well. Um, as you saw from the opening credits there, been on a bit of a walk this morning. Went to meet my old mum at Asda. Uh, bless her, she took me for a coffee. Wanted to get me a sandwich, but they stopped doing them. I missed breakfast time, so... Look, I'm just on a walk round, just keen to get a vlog out. Um, I won't show you much of this walk because you've seen it before. This has been on a previous video, but I will link that video. Um, I'll put it down below in the comments just to walk in the local area. This is what we call the Rothwell Greenway. So it used to be a um, railway line uh, that went down all the way from Loft House in that direction right into Leeds, into Sturton on the outskirts of Leeds. So I'm just having a little wander around here. So all I really wanted to do today was just update you on what's been going on, what I've been doing, how the job search is going. Thanks to all of those who've asked, who've messaged, who've commented asking what I've been doing. It means the world to me. So yeah, obviously, if you've not seen me before or seen my previous vlogs, you'll know that I lost my job uh, about 10 days ago. Not this Monday, the Monday before got called in. I'd been there under six months, so I got called in for my... What I thought was my normal monthly review to find out I'd been binned off. Um, and if you saw my last vlog at New Miller Dam, when it was pouring down, that really was a depressing day. That was the Tuesday. That was the day after. You'll know that I got a couple of phone calls um, that morning from somebody who wanted to interview me. Yeah, before I go on, I just thought I'd show you this. So this is the old railway line. Look at this. And it looked beautiful in autumn. And see all the leaves that have fallen off the trees really is a gorgeous place this I come down here with the dog often it's a nice walk sometimes there's a little bit too many dogs we're all doing the same thing in the same place and it can get a little bit mental especially if people have got them off the lead because my dog's very inquisitive and he just tugs and wants to go see them and then sometimes it's hard to get him walking again but yeah anyway I got I got those two phone calls and I actually ended up going to an interview that afternoon um, and it's been quite weird really got on well with the guy interviewed well I was there an hour and a half with him more or less a chat really rather than what you call a physical interview um, really nice bloke we had the chat like I say and then that night he sent me a couple of text messages well we swapped a couple of text messages him saying look I really like it do you fancy it and me saying yeah look you know go for it um, and then he left it he just said look I've got to go find out if we can get you a decent salary because they, they won't pay quite as much as I was on but still enough um, and he just said let me come back to you so that was obviously the Tuesday Wednesday he rang me saying I'd like to make you a job offer so he could do the salary um, he just said look we've got a brand new car waiting for you uh, we just had some new company cars delivered one of them will be yours and I'll see how quick I can get you on boarded. What you'll get next is a sort of written offer, just a, I guess an informal email saying this is the job, just for my peace of mind. Um, and he said I should have that in the next sort of 24 hours. Anyway, time rolled on, didn't hear anything. Rang me on Friday last week, so today is Friday, so it was a week ago today, saying, listen, sorry I haven't sent that over to you, but we can't start you. He was trying to actually get me to start. Monday coming so just about 10 days away and I didn't think he'd be able to do it I thought it was a bit too too soon to be honest but anyway he said no we can't do that we're going to be looking at probably uh, a week on the Monday um, but I'll be in touch I'll let you know anyway still not had anything in writing told him he said he'd get it over at the weekend it still didn't come so anyway that brings us to this week now, I've had an absolute shocker of a week really um, the one saving grace has been walking. I've walked so far this week on dog walks, walks on my own. I just have to get out of the house. It's just been, yeah, it's been tough. I've got a cold now. I've come down with a cough. I've had what I feel is like a stress headache um, for almost a week now. It's not been great. So I've not heard anything again. I swapped a, a couple of texts with him on Tuesday and he was like, look, I'll get something over to you. Didn't. And then I rang him on Wednesday and it just seemed to be a bit of a, oh, don't know, uh, see what I can do. Um, you'll hear soon anyway. I didn't until this morning. And then, lo and behold, a contract has turned up. So it's looking like, folks, all's well that ends well. And I'm going to be going back into employment pretty soon. 
But yeah, look at that weather. Can't beat it, can you? Autumn in England. So yeah, if you look through here, look. There's the farmer's fields. Pan round. That area over there is called Carlton. You can see the white building there is the pub. That's the rosebud. I hope you can pick that up. And then here you've got this uh, sort of little clearing with all these stones that I always find interesting. Some nice pictures if you get the light properly um, and you get the, the leaves going brown and the bushes here. You can get an absolutely lovely picture which I'll try and take at some point. But yeah, if you walk over to this, you can see here, look. There's all these little carvings on that rock. But yeah, nice place of solitude. It's good for the mind. So just a bit of what I've got coming up on the channel, hopefully. I've still got a couple of Corfu vlogs to come on that playlist. If you've not checked that out, have a look at it. Um, there, I've got a good one, which is on a 360 bike, uh, quad bike on the 360 camera, sorry, which does look amazing. They've got some amazing views. So that one's nearly done. I'm hoping to get that one up probably early next week, Monday maybe, or Sunday, and this one you should see tonight. Um, and then other than that, I did do one on, I had to take my car back to my old employer on Monday in Hull, and I did try and vlog that, I drove over there, I um, got the train, walked from the depot into Hull, into Hull Paragon Station, and then got the train back, and I was hoping to show you that, but I just wasn't in the mood, I don't think it was a particularly good vlog, so I'll just show you a couple of bits. Um, over the top now that you can see of that journey but I'd, I looked back and I thought no nah, I can't be bothered with that so that sun's blaring behind isn't it I've got a filter on here called a black mist so when it's sunny like this it's meant to give it like a dreamy effect so I hope that works and it's clearing off my balding head isn't it probably overexposing so that's what I've got coming up I've got I've got that one the the 360 camera on the quad and I've also got a um, travel home day vlog to come, which I like doing. That's the one of the, of the journey back. It wasn't eventful, it was okay, pretty smooth. But yeah, I'll show you that. So that's the next couple of vlogs, folks, coming up. So look, as I've said, your support means the world to me. Um, really does. It's uh, been a tough time. I'll admit this week, I was in bits last week, to be honest. I wasn't in a good place, but this week when I'm thinking... You know, and I didn't, I didn't go out and boast that I'd got a new job. I kept it quiet until, I think it was the Thursday or the Friday when he rang me again to say, yep, look, this is what I'm looking at. This is what we're looking at doing. Um, I was like, yeah, look, I've definitely got this, haven't I? But until that contract comes and that offer, you're just not too sure, are you? So this week's not been the best week for me, uh, mentally wise. But thank God for walking. I nearly swore then. Thank God for walking because it's kept me saying the weather's been pretty nice when it has rained i've missed it somehow i don't know how given the amount i've walked had an odd shower but apart from that no no rain and then um yeah this last couple of days has just been stunning i think i walked something like 15k yesterday over about three separate walks so it's been decent for my mental and physical health so i've just come to the end here now you can hear somebody drilling over there no doubt but that's where the track bed would have gone in that direction. There's a bridge down there that went over to the station, which was over there. This is years ago, folks, this. I mean, I'm talking 70, 80 years ago that all this was in operation. And you can see it all, all the way back there. Look, right into the distance, that's where I've walked. It's not a massive walk down here. It looks longer than it is. You get down to the bottom pretty quickly. But yeah, I'll link that other video. Like I say, I'll put it in the description and you can just do go into detail a bit more about the surrounding area but that's it i'll leave it here thanks for watching only a quick one just wanted to update you really um if you've just stumbled across me please do that subscribe like it means the world like i say i'm only a small channel i have put about another 10 subscribers on this week so it's ticking up there nicely i think i'm on about 615 now something like that as i as i go out as i left the house today so if you can subscribe it doesn't cost you a penny and it means the world to me so thanks for watching speak soon